The most hotly contested election from last November was in the Virginia governor's race, where Democrat and former Governor Terry McAuliffe faced off against Republican first-time candidate Glenn Youngkin. Youngkin was able to win this race by about two points to become the first Republican elected statewide in Virginia since 2009. Our Edison Research exit poll helps explain how he did it. During the campaign, McAuliffe attempted to make the election a referendum on former President Donald Trump, warning that a vote for Youngkin was essentially a vote for Trump. But exit poll data shows that this message did not really stick, and in the end, voters found Youngkin much more appealing than Trump. This was particularly true with independent voters, where Youngkin had a plus 20 net favorability compared to Trump's net favorability of negative 28. Winning over these independents proved to be a key element of Youngkin's victory this year, as he carried them by nine points. This stands in stark contrast to Trump's performance among independents during the 2020 general, where he lost them by 18 points, according to our exit poll. It's worth noting that Youngkin also had a higher net favorability than Trump among Virginia Republicans this year. This allowed him to improve his vote share with Virginia GOP voters compared to Trump in 2020. Elections are never won and lost for a single reason, but Youngkin's ability to establish his own brand from Donald Trump appears to be a key reason for his victory this year.